one of the things that that is that's great about what I get to do is I get to experience so much stuff and a lot of it is pretty high quality whether it's local people or whether it's these national international artists and you, you have these really nice experiences with the and and somebody pays me to do it you know like I say I don't know what would I do if I had to get a real job you know <laughs> On a local artist, I don't see, whether it's music or visual art or film or whatever, I don't see the point of beating up some local person in the paper if I don't like it, right? I don't, I don't see what good that does for anybody. Uh, and secondly, um, you want to write about things that you think are worthy of note, right? And when you got four art reviews in a month, then you better write about four good things rather than tear apart two or three bad ones just to show that you can do it. When you write some kind of criticism, some kind of in opinion stuff, you are by almost by definition advocating some kind of a position. But overall, yeah, I would hope that I, you know, I kind of am happy that maybe people see me that way because I really do believe that, you know, the arts are really important and vital and people don't realize they're engaged with the arts a lot of times when they are and maybe they need to be more overtly aware of that and maybe some of that I can bring to that. I went to see Jerry Lee Lewis at a little place outside of Grand Island years ago and was talking to him before and then he said, you sit right here, he made me sit on the floor next to the piano. So I'm sitting, you know, 10, five feet away from Jerry Lee when he's just going crazy, right? So you're never gonna forget something like that either.